I didn't want people to go to this movie and and because I, I could see through the other movies there was a sense of the audience of yeah Mike you know go get him go get him bring him down yeah all right ah that feels good ah. <laughs> And I can understand I, why the audience enjoys cathartically living through me as their representative on, on the screen. So uh, I, I respect that, and I'm, I won't stop doing that. Uh, but, uh, but, uh, but I guess I reached a point after the 2004 election uh, where um, say what you want about the funny business in Ohio, Mr. Bush did get more popular votes than Mr. Kerry. The majority of Americans did want more of the same after they had been exposed to four years of what we had. That was a turning point for me. Um, and, and I decided to deal with it in two ways. One, to make a film where no longer was Mike going to do your work for you. Uh, you were going to have to join with me in changing this. And and number two, uh, I was going to reach out in whatever way I could in the making of this film across the great political divide um, because I believe that there are a number of people who don't necessarily share my or some of your political viewpoints, but would agree we could find some common ground on this particular issue. And, and I know that there are a lot of depressed Republicans these days, and I thought that, you know, instead of beating them up for being so crazy and nutty, <laughs> if we held out our hand to them, some of them would come over. And so, um, as these guys know, when I wrote that $12,000 check to the uh, anti-Michael Moore website, uh, uh, I debated for a year whether or not to even put it in the film. Uh, and, uh, um, and the debate in my own head was that I, um, I shouldn't write this check if I'm doing it just to put it in the film. I should do it because it's the right thing to do. And I had to ask myself the question, would you write this check uh, if you weren't going to put it in the film, would you actually give this hateful person twelve thousand dollars of your own money? And um, and when I could answer that question honestly and say yes, that that is the way I was raised, that you're to love your enemies and and you're to reach out to them. Um, uh, that that's when I did it, and I eventually put it in the film because I thought um, I would like to perhaps set somewhat of an example <clears throat> for those of us on our side of the political fence to reach out to those who are not like us um, if we're going to try and you know, change some things. And so, um, um, and so, that's, so that, that was my thinking, and that's why this film is a little different uh, uh, than the others. And uh, I hope there's enough humor in it to where people aren't, like I said, too paralyzed by it.